Oh, thank oh. God, like this little life. <laughs> So we just arrived in Andorra, we flew to Barcelona and it's a two and a half hour drive from Barcelona to Andorra. And when we landed in Barca, I just really, I felt really, really sick. We sat in the car and when we stopped halfway, I threw up. And when we arrived here, I threw up. So I'm gonna rest here. I have my Pringles and Coca-Cola and then we'll see uh, how I feel tomorrow on Friday and then it's the race on Saturday. Andorra! It is great! Okay, so I feel way better today. I did like two rounds of GS in the slope here in Andorra. Feel ready for the race tomorrow, but it's steep. You can see the course. Holy shit! Don't be lied. That's steep. steep. What do you say? Don't be lied. Don't be lied. By the steepness. It's flat? It's not flat, but it's not that steep. Holy shit. The team host is insane. Look at this. It's Saturday. I'm done with inspection. Uh, it's like rainy, snowy. Really looking forward to it. I think I'm ready to, to try to attack. Come on! Guys, on. Number 16 on pours. GS in Andorra is done. I came 20. I can't film anything because it's so stressful to do GS. Anyways, here's the ski room. Thea is was five, I think. Uh, Mina is seven. Hola. Oh, they just going down. Hello, Thea. Yeah. Hello. Luck in, good luck in the salon, you guys. Thank you, Zaggy. Thank you. Hola. Hola. Hola, Barça. We have one day in Barça. But I think everything is closed, so we're gonna see uh, what we can find out today, Ragnar. Uh, okay. So yeah, it's gonna be fun, and then we fly over to Kramontana uh, tomorrow. You're doing great. Well, you've never seen a girl watching a car before. <laughs> You're doing great. <laughs> Alright, we're in Kramontana. <laughs> and as always, it's warm and nice weather. So let's hope it's gonna stay like that the whole week. It's so freaking warm here. It's like spring snow. So wet. They have to salt the downhill. And then we have to dry every single thing we have. Oh my god. It's a pretty nice room though. Going into the bed here and this view. Perfect, a little too good for me. I ain't say no trouble, but trouble's got you knocking on my feet. First race, a little too good for me. You will not be ready. <laughs> Ciao Bellas! Oh. <laughs> Let's hear Feda! Good morning, Garda. How's your neck, Ragnar? Very good. Can you do this? If I can do this. Ma la velocità qua spigola. Hi, Toki. Hi. You're so cute. 
Okay, let's go. Det är er inte kul när du går ut för oss. After Carmen there's an 8-9 hour drive to San Pellegrino where the next two Super G races are this weekend. It's a 9 hour drive, so we figured why not just stop in beautiful Lake Garda, as you can see. I'm wearing shorts. I'm on for a run. That's crazy. You ski in the weekend, you go here, you can wear shorts, and then we're going to San Pellegrino, and it's gonna be like half a meter fresh snow. Oh, FIFA! Leg day. Leg day. Morning, San Pellegrino. Today we have some filming with head over here. Hey. <laughs> machine. Thank you. <laughs> Volleyball. That's very race prep today. So the rules in our team is that every Friday we wear dalle, and for every new person joining the team, they need to have a presentation about themselves. So today it's our new physio Henrik's turn to tell us who he is and uh, some fun facts about him. Um, different ages. We're in San Pellegrino and that's actually where I crashed. So I'm back uh, racing here for the first time. But I'm actually looking forward to it because it's such a nice place and conditions are usually quite good. And it wasn't because of San Pellegrino I crashed. It was just, um, yeah, I just had really bad luck. I think it's going to be emotional and yeah, but I think... I'm definitely gonna have fun. It's Saturday, first Super G race got cancelled because of 60 centimeters of snow. So that brings me the opportunity to go paragliding. It's already delayed with 30 minutes. Sunday, we just heard race is cancelled. Marta can't have her Super G debut. No, and Henrik cannot have his Fisio debut in World Cup. But now the sun is shining though. It's usually like that. It gets cancelled and then the sun comes out. Mm. 